This is the default OpenPages logon page. In this video, we will demonstrate how to configure this page to add an alert, privacy statements, and a checkbox that the user will need to tick before they can log into the system. First, let's log into OpenPages as administrator, and let's switch to the standard UI. We now go to Administration, Application Text. Here, we need to expand Labels. There's actually quite a few labels here, so it'll take a bit of time to load. And in order for us to search this easily, we'll do a search on Logon, and then find the next entry. And here we can see several that's highlighted. First, let's expand the system notice text label. Now if we expand this and edit the text for the locale we are using, we can put a text here to be displayed as an alert. I will enter a system outage text and save that. Again, we can do the search to jump back into the position. Just above that, we can see the system notice header. This is actually the heading that goes with the system notice text that you can also edit if you wish. By default, as we can see, the value is system noticed. So we'll just leave that for now. Next, let's add a checkbox text so that the user will need to tick this in order to proceed to log into the system. So if we expand this and edit the value in our locale, we'll just put some value here and a checkbox will appear on the home page. Let's go back down to our texts. Now, let's add a privacy text. For that, we expand the privacy text. Same as before, you just click on the locale you want to edit and enter the text you want to display here. Do note that these texts are HTML formatted, so you can add HTML formatting if you wish. Lastly, we can also provide the user with a link which takes a click, which would take them to another website, which displays uh, some privacy text. So for that, if we look at the default value for this link, we can see the heading will be privacy statement. To add the actual link, we need to go to administration, settings, And then if we expand applications common, there's a failure here, privacy link URL. Here, you can enter the URL that will link to your company privacy statement. So we'll just put a, a sample here. 
Now let's see our changes. First we log out the system. Now see at the top the system notice is popped up. Also here is the checkbox that we added and here is the privacy text. And lastly here is the privacy statement URL link. Thank you for watching this video.